Ah, the majesty of a spring storm. It's perfect weather for a brisk walk. Don't you think, Sprocket? It's only water, Sprocket. It'll be like taking a bath. You mean you really don't want to go out for a walk with me? Uh, what am I going to do with this piece of red licorice? <laughs> That's the spirit. And got you. Close your eyes and count to three. I've got just the thing for you. You can't even guess. It's a lightning deflector. Ah, now, in the unlikely event that you were struck by lightning, this rod here would collect the electricity and channel it down through the coil of this transformer. Of course, I haven't tested this invention yet. But... Ow! Oh, what are you doing, Wembley? I've got to go out there and get my mail. But one of the creatures out there has a helmet on. A helmet? Yeah, he's dressed for battle. <gasps> it's not me! Shh! It's Wembley. It's exaggerating. Why? There's nothing out there to worry about. Gobo, you can't go out there. Wembley, a fraggle's got to live by the rule of the rock. Why, sure, it's dangerous out there. But I got my duty to think about. Think about getting an acting teacher, Gobo. Ha uh ha, -huh. very funny. I just hope there's a postcard from my Uncle Traveling Matt. I'm starting to get worried. Well, I hope he's gonna be okay. Mm. Hey, where you going? I can't stand the tension. <sighs> so that's how your lightning deflector works. You see, simple as pie. I know you're not convinced. Ooh. Postcard again today. <sighs> This. Well, will you come for a walk tomorrow, then? <laughs> you will? That's fantastic. The newspaper said it's going to be really stormy tomorrow. Oh, there, there. Here, have another piece of licorice. <laughs> Lint. Sorry about that. Sometimes those creatures are really bizarre.